Question 223. How can you limit the stream? Short answer, there is a method for that. Less short answer. Technically speaking, you are not really limiting a stream. What you're saying is that when that stream processes the given amount of object, it should stop. And you need to be careful because at each stage, what you get is a new stream object. If what you need is to skip the first two elements and the last two elements, then if you write the following code, what you get is not what you expect because you forgot that the stream on which you call limit consumes only four elements, not six. So the correct code is this one. One last word, skip and limit only makes sense on ordered streams and both manage an internal mutable counter. So don't use them in parallel streams.